I recently watched this anime and they use this splash effect when they are fighting. So I decided to recreate my own style. I place my camera in front of my eyes to take the first shot and switch to the second shot where I'm about to draw something out and lastly the main shot. With my first footage select in the timeline which I had a glow to the eyes just to make the first scene look good and switch to the second shot where I'm about to draw something out. Create a new solid layer and off it. Click on the pencil tools and mask around the pipe. Press M and click the stopwatch. Begin to adjust the mask to match the pipe movement. After done, on the layer back and search for vector noise. Add it to the layer and change the vector type to cloudly, brightness to 25, and add the tint effect. Adjust the color to blue and add perfect glow effect. Change the glow threshold to 34 and the mode to add. Create adjustment layer and copy the mask part frame from the solid layer. Then click the adjustment layer and paste it. Add it distortion and play with the distortion amount. For the last shot, create a solid layer and off the layer. Click the Pencil tools and mask. On the layer back and add the Saba effect. Open the customized corel and change the corel type to layer mask. Change the mode to hard and enable the 3D. Click the watch time on position, scale and mask part. Press U and adjust the mask to follow the pipe. And there we go. Hope this tutorial helps you. And until next time we meet, keep creating epic videos. Thank <laughs> you.